Hello everyone, welcome to solve this math Olympiad algebra problem and here we have x square minus x cubed equals to 80 and we solve this problem for the values of x. So here the very first step we are going to do is here first we focus in the right hand side and we break this 80 and it is written as x square minus x cubed equals to 80 and we write this 80 as 64 plus 16 we know that 64 plus 16 equals to 80 and after that uh, we have x square minus x cubed equals to 64 and we write the 64 as 4 cubed and we write the 16 as 4 square and after uh, this step uh, we move all the terms from right hand side to the left hand side and it is written as in this form uh, x square minus x cubed e uh, and we move these terms in the left hand side so this is plus 4 cube it is written as minus 4 cube and this is plus 4 square is written as minus 4 square and this whole equation equals to 0 so here we make the pairs of cubic term with cubic term and the square term with square term so uh, first we have the cube square term is x square minus 4 square and here we have these two are the cubic terms so here we take common minus sign from these two terms and it is written as x plus x cubed plus 4 cubed equals to 0 so here we need uh, two nice formulas uh, so the one formula is the square identity and the other formula is the cubic identity so you very well know about these formulas if we have a square minus b square it is equals to a minus b times of a plus b and the cubic formula is a cubed plus b cubed it is equals to a plus b times of a square minus a b plus b square okay so this is the uh, cubic formula so here we need these two formulas to solve our above equation uh, so now first we uh, use the square formula in the first term uh, so our first term is written as in this form so this is x square minus 4 square so we write it as x minus 4 times of x plus 4 minus here we use the cubic formula so according to this formula it is written as x plus 4 into uh, x square minus x into 4 and plus 4 square and this whole equation equals to 0 so further you see here we have x plus 4 be the common term so we take common x plus 4 and we get its remaining terms are so here you take common x plus 4 and remaining terms are x minus 4 minus here we take common x plus 4 and we remaining terms are x square minus 4x plus 16 and this whole equals to 0. So further uh, we need uh, some simplifications uh, and we write it as x plus 4 into <coughs> x minus 4 and we multiply this negative sign on all of these terms and it is written as minus x square plus 4x minus 16 equals to 0. So now <clears throat> in the next step uh, here uh, we need more simplifications and we write this equation as x plus 4 times of uh, x minus 4 so this is x plus 4x equals to 5x and minus 4 minus 16 equals to minus 20 and this is minus x square equals to 0. So after that uh, now we convert this equation into the two cases so that our first case is we take x plus 4 equals to 0 and the second case is we take 5x minus 20 minus x square equals to 0 so from uh, this we have x equals to minus 4 so this is the our first real solution 
and now in order to find the other solutions we need to solve this quadratic equation so that uh, uh, first we write this quadratic equation into the standard form so that we multiplying on both of the sides by minus 1 okay when you multiply both sides by minus 1 it is written as minus 5x plus 20 plus x squared equals to 0 so here we rearrange the terms and we write it as x square minus 5x plus 20 equals to 0. So now uh, the time to uh, make the factors of this equation or applying the quadratic formula. So that here we apply the quadratic formula to solve this quadratic equation. So first we write the coefficients of this equation and its coefficients are a equals to 1 b equals to minus 5 and c equals to 20. So uh, we use the quadratic formula and it is stated as minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times of ac and it is divided by 2 times of a. So now we uh, use uh, the values of a, b and c here and it is written as uh, minus b and b is minus 5 plus minus square root of b square so b is minus 5 square minus 4 times of a is 1 and c is 20 and this is divided by 2 so here we uh, rewrite this expression as 5 plus minus we know that square root of 5 is 20 minus 4 times of 20 becomes here 80 and this is divided by 2. So that now we simplify the terms here and we subtract 25 by 80 and it is written as x equals to 5 plus minus square root of 25 minus 80 equals to minus 65 and it is divided by 2 and here uh, we uh, just uh, break uh, this square root sign and we write the square root on both of these terms separately and it is written as 5 plus minus square root of 65 into square root of minus 1 and it is divided by 2 so finally we have x equals to 5 plus minus square root of 65 into iota and it is divided by 2 so these are the two complex roots of the given equation uh, and we have only one real root of the given equation and this root is x is equals to minus 4 these are the three roots of the given equation and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.